Hey everyone, Reptile Sam here. Today I will show you how to handle a feisty sand boa. So, that little stripe in the sand you see, that's a little danger noodle. That is Boba, my sand boa, and he is over a year old, but he is fairly small for his age. So Boba is a little bit nippier than other sand boas usually are. And sand boas in general can be a pretty nippy species. It is usually because they're buried in their sand and so they can't see you coming for them. Uh, even though when their eyes are exposed, they still can have a tendency to take a quick nip at you because they're not sure if you're food or a predator or what you could be. So my solution is using a small reptile hook like this to get Boba out of his enclosure and then handle him rather than reaching in directly. Now I know sand as a substrate for sand boas is not always preferred. A lot of people use aspen, um, which I think I might try aspen bedding with Boba at some point. Um, he does seem to re really enjoy his sand though. And right now he's buried on top of his heat mat, um, which is set at 99 degrees. So I'm going to extend my reptile hook and then get up underneath him. So there's his tail. And we're going to get him out so he can, he knows that we're here. And I'm going to put our hand underneath him and place Boba into my hand. So now that Boba's on my hand, he won't be nippy because he's already here. Boba is a really pretty snake. He is n normal colored for sand boa. He looks very pale right now because um, his sand is kind of dusty, um, which I don't like about it too much. Um, but if I were to put him under some water, it would come right off and you'd see how bright and pretty his coloring can be. Um, he's very warm. He's just laying on his heat mat. And so here he is, this, this is Boba, and he's a normal colored sand boa. He's a bit small for a male. Most males get bigger than this, but Boba is only around a year old, um, a little, little over a year. So Boba will probably get bigger, um, but males are drastically smaller than females. So Boba uh, can be nippy sometimes, but like I sh just showed you, if you use the hook to get out your sand boa and then place them on the palm of your hand, they're less likely to try to bite you. And once they're out, they're really friendly little guys. They're not super curious. Um, they'll be happy to just rest in your palm because they don't climb very well being sand boas. So they'll just like to sit in your hand and let you kind of hold them. Um, and yeah, so that's about it. That's how you can handle your sand boa and uh, without them getting frustrated with you and um, let them know that you're coming with a snake hook uh, to get them out. So here's Boba once again, so you can meet the little fellow. And I'll do more videos. For now, this is Reptile Sam.